Yeah, um, <laughs> I just clicked record and I'm like, I'm bored. Listen, I was home all week, all week. I didn't do a thing. And today I have sushi plans with some girlfriends. There are a few things that I need today and we're gonna go on a journey. The first thing that I need is a candle, fall candle. I think that's a good plan. Okay, I just parked at Target and it's as if the entire city was like, oh, I wanna go to Target today on Sunday on a cloudy day. The whole parking lot is full. I'm making eye contact with like five people right now. Um, anyway, we have a mission. We're not here to fool around. I don't want to fool around. Where I need to get some candles, cleaning supplies. I think I'm ready to go. I'm nervous. I think I'm gonna get overstimulated, but everyone's here too. Yikes. All right, let's go. just got done I survived and it's just about raining um, I think I'm gonna go to anthropology because what else am I gonna do I did spend $83 at Target so I'll show you guys when I'm home a little bit of a haul we'll see what I bought and yeah. my windshield wipers are kind of broken all right Let's head out. I don't know how to get there except as GPS. Oh, I can go? Okay, thank you. Oh my God, yay. <laughs> That was a great interaction. <sighs> oh, the little things, honestly. Oh my God, Anthropology is having a 30% off sale. This dress, it is an extra large, but I don't know. You never know. Then we have this skirt. I thought it was really cute. And then we have these pants, which I know are size too small, but I think they're really cool looking. Then we have these pants, which look at the back. Okay, I think Jen, my friend, has the same ones, but in a different color. I don't know. Then we have oops, these. Let the try on begin. Do I have like body dysmorphia? These are way too big and I'm too short. So let's try on those. These are too big. Oh my God. <laughs> but again, not the fit. I just don't know like what top would I wear it with. Hello, back in my car. Got a couple things from Anthropology. Let's head home and it's four o'clock and we need to meet the girls at 6.30. So I have enough time to do a little bit of a haul and also, yeah, maybe clean up a little bit because I my makeup is like melting off. So let's head out. And I didn't get a candle from Anthropology. It was like $38 and I got two for 20 at Target. So that's where my good thinking skills came intact. All right, let's go. Okay, I am back. I'm glad I went out because right now it is 4.30. I have about 
an hour and a half ish to go until dinner time. So let me share what I got from Target. It may not be a fun haul because it's just not the fun things, but I needed them. So first and foremost, I got a Swiffer wet mopping cloths. Yes, and I got the lavender smell. So this should be good because I'm looking at my wooden floors and they are looking a little bit dull. And so this should be good. I actually haven't stocked up on this in six years. Yeah. Okay, so the next thing I got is this Smart Mouth Bad Breath Prevention Mouthwash. And I heard that this is a really good brand. I'll link everything down below so you can get it from Amazon, but I've used this before and it's good. The next thing I got is 48 of these Cascade <laughs> Platinum Dishwasher Pods. Apparently, you're not supposed to put the pod in the little container. You're supposed to just throw it in the bottom of your dishwasher. I had no idea. So I got these. I feel like these dry out really easily. And so it's very important to keep it very secured um, in like a tight seal container. So I'm glad I stocked up on these because I don't know, it is so nice when I don't have dishes sitting in the sink for me to hand wash and I can just put them in the dishwasher. I think that this is a great investment. Oh, I'm so glad I thought of these to buy, but I got four of these Flamingo cartridges. I'll show you what they look like if I can open it. But basically I got the Flamingo razor, the pink razor, and I just buy new blades and that's it. And I've never really stuck to like buying parts of a product for the sake of recycling, but I'm really glad I've been sticking to this very well. And so this is what it looks like. Oops. And so inside are these little blades and then I'll just attach it to the razor and works pretty well for me. I don't really have any issues. Okay, oh shoot, I should have left this in my car. <laughs> Next up, I got the Island Fresh uh, car smell Febreze. One of those car smelly things, um, yeah. I realized that my car is smelling like a crayon again, and I need to pop one of these in. So maybe I'll open that right now so I don't forget. Well, I'll do it later. I found some concealer. This is the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in Light Medium. Okay, next up are the candles. So I was a little tame today. I didn't need to like get a billion candles. I'll just go next time, but here's the first one. And the trick to smelling candles, I don't know if you know this, is you have to open it up and smell this part. Oh my God, it smells so good. It smells, it's called Autumn Sugared Leaves. This smells like a winter morning walking through an aisle of Christmas trees. My last candle of the day is Cinnamon Pumpkin Muffin. Oh my God, it smells so good. These candles are so good because they're soy, where it doesn't have car fumes, basically, and they're only $10. I saw a candle at Anthropology. It was one of their pumpkin editions, and it was $38. I was like, no candle for me today. Oh my God, I cannot wait to light this up. Don't forget to cut your wicks before you light them. Now, I wanna show you guys what I got from Anthropology. Couldn't really find anything, honestly. Oh, I got, okay, so my favorite scent is called, is from this perfume called Toka and the Florence smell. Let me tell you a story about this perfume really fast. Um, I was absolutely more than I've ever been in love with a guy before. So one time I met this guy um, in 2018 in fall and we had like a brief romance. We went to Waco with his cousin and her friend or his family member. And it was my first time meeting anyone in his family. And his cousin wore this perfume and I was like, hey, you smell so good. Like I have to know what, you, what you're wearing. And she's like, oh, I went to this store and they had this Toka perfume in the scent Florence. And I was like, I couldn't stop smelling. <laughs> like it smelled incredible. And so I saw the perfume at Anthropology, and I kind of wanted to get it, but it was like $25 for a little container. 
So I thought, why not just get the hand lotion? And if I love it enough again, I did get the perfume initially and I ran out, but I don't know. I, don't, I kind of want to try different scents. And so I decided to just get the, um, the hand lotion. Not a day goes by that I do not think about that guy, honestly. Um, literally, oh my God. It just reminds me of like being with him in Waco. That was like one of the best times of my life. And now he is engaged as they always are. They're like all the guys that I talk to right now are engaged, all of them. The ones that I had a relationship with, all of them are engaged to everyone but me, but I'm happy for all of the guys. <laughs> um, yeah, it's crazy how scents just really take you back. Oh, this is a very good hand lotion. Ooh, it's a very subtle smell of the Florence scent, but yeah, oh, this is a great hand lotion. Okay, and you know what? I'm not typically like a hand lotion kind of gal, but this is absolutely fantastic. I'm like very happy with this. The last thing I got from Anthropology is, oh my God, the cutest, fall mug. I thought this would be perfect for all of the fall content that I'm going to be doing in September and October. Look at how cute. It's a pumpkin mug and it was only $7.95. I was like, bring her to me. Oh my God, I love. This is gonna be so, so perfect. I'm really, really excited about this. All right, see you soon. Hello, okay, I am ready to go to dinner. Basically, my makeup is so blotchy at the moment, you can't really tell because of the camera, but I'm so excited for dinner to be over, only for me to come home <laughs> and wash my face, wash my hair, and yeah, but I'm so excited to have sushi. I'm gonna be meeting up with three of my creative girls. Actually, one of the girls is meeting another one of the girls. So it's kind of like a little blind friend date because they have a lot in common. So I'm so excited. I should probably head out soon because I need to go find some parking downtown and also secure a table for all of us. Part of me feels like I'm gonna be cold, but I don't really know. And it's a little risky to wear white pants to a sushi restaurant, so we shall see. Um, yeah, I'm ready to head out. So I will see you guys at dinner. Um, I think I have everything. No, I don't need sunglasses because I need to stop wearing them on my head. Oh my God, it feels so short from that angle. Um, okay, well, I've got my bag. Should I take a nicer bag? No, oh, wait, let me turn this off. I'm gonna like come home with this camera set up staring right back at me and it's gonna freak me out. I really hope I don't get cold. Um, anyway, okay guys, I will see you soon. Just parked. Let's go. Yikes, look at what I'm dealing with. You're in right there. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hi. With the girls. Did we have a nice dinner? It was amazing. So good. Now we're eating so mints. Cool. 
Who got mints? Oh. Did you get mints? <laughs> no. Um, Thank you, mints. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Hello. That was so fun. Okay. So, I am going to take a shower and take off all of this man. <laughs> I feel like I'm telling a spooky story. Anyway, um, I will see you guys in my next video. I hope you're subscribed, and if you want more vlogs like this, please give it a thumbs up so I know. Love you guys. Kisses.